cities have powered the world economy for centuries. As a nation with over a billion people experiencing rapid urbanization, India is positioned to grow as a world power in the coming decade. But this requires innovation and transportation infrastructure that will support and accelerate economic growth. India is now in need of a long-term, forward-thinking solution. Hyperloop One is the company creating a new mode of transportation that can move India. Hyperloop is fast, cost-efficient and sustainable. It's electric, energy-efficient and will complement overtaxed railways and roads through reduced congestion and pollution. Out our technology, see a live test, see about the first system that's going to be built in India, see exactly what he's going to get for that. I was really impressed with the whole delegation's ability to want to push this project forward and do it very fast and their commitment after seeing the technology and showing how quickly we built the technology here in Nevada, understanding how we can do that inside of India and they are trying to find ways to help us do that even faster than we ever thought possible. To be where we are now, when a year ago we were at the Vision for India event where we were looking at different routes all around the country is pretty incredible. The people came to us and said, we want to see a Hyperloop technology in India. We want to see this exist. Right now it takes about three and a half hours to do the trip between Mumbai and Pune by road. Uh, if you take a train, it takes about five or six hours. There's only two flights a week because it's such a short distance and it's very difficult to get to the airports. We're basically saying we can do it in 25 minutes, which is a huge improvement from the status quo. Today was all about viewing our technology in real time, in real life. And nothing prepares you until you come here and then see it for yourself. When you see the tube, when you see the, the pod, when you see the control room, you see the people are actually been making history. That to me is when really it is no longer for me to imagination. This is now. State 3 testing, we've achieved up to 107 meters per second velocity. So the ring lights are placed about 40 meters apart from each other. So as the pod is accelerating, uh, you can really get a sense of how fast we're going. The biggest challenge with the installation of the LED lights, we found that we had uh, some problems with the diffuser material, and so we had to quickly locate a second source. We went into town uh, and went to some of the local supply shops, and surprisingly in the roofing section, we found some corrugated white material that looked like it might work very well. We bought uh, all the material that they had in the store and sent it over to our metal workshop, where they used the water jet to cut it into a bunch of strips, we brought it back onto site, went into the two and we set these lights at the 40 meter increments. You can set them to any color you want and it really gives a good frame of reference for the pod velocity and you could even have a dance party inside. 